Now it's time to have a baby. It's time to have a baby. I'm finna go get induced. Um, I'm not doing my baby hair. Cause my son don't care about that. Okay, I'm not finna have edge control seeping down my forehead while I'm trying to push. I'm just not worried about it. And y'all see that curl pattern? Oh, don't play. What it do, y'all? I'm about to go get induced. Today is my due date. I'm officially 40 weeks. He's getting too big, and it's time to get him up out of here. I'm getting induced at 8.30. It's 6 o'clock now. My mom is here. She's going to finish the rest of the cleaning while me and dad are check into the hospital. And me and dad are going to go get some snacks. The bags are already packed. Everything's already done. I was two centimeters dilated, and I was contracting like every 20 minutes earlier this week but i couldn't feel my contractions because i just was in phase one now i'm starting to feel the contractions i don't know how much i'm dilated so we're gonna find out when we get to this hospital <sighs> Woo! it ain't nothing to a real g you know what i'm saying i ain't gonna be in pain this shit hurt i ain't gonna be screaming i ain't gonna be yelling this ain't gonna hurt this ain't gonna hurt you can't hurt a real gangster that's just as simple as that you can't we in walmart we're going to get a ring light. Dad had to piss me off because he went and got geeked out his mind. So he's killing my fucking vibe. Cause now I feel like she lying on me. So we at Dollar General now, trying to get some snacks. Dad I said I brought him to the off brand and snacks. That's uh, mountain do. Yep, sure. Yeah. Thank you. I'll just take one. Look. Them hoes used to fuck. You know you had, um used to eat off brand chips, but please don't add brand new. They got little cheese at Snaps. You know you used to fuck with them. Oh yeah, yeah, I still do fuck with them. Okay, so we just made it into labor and delivery, and we about to check into our room. We here on time, you know. So how you feeling? A little nervous? When he got geeked out his mind, we gonna just show y'all once we get into the room what it's looking like. I'm a big bitch. Look at my mm -hmm. neck. Mm -hmm. You gonna faint? Oh, shit, please don't faint. Okay, y'all, so I'm in the hospital. We checked in. I did all my little paperwork and shit. They put the IV. Bitch, this shit hurt. I ain't gonna be in pain. The nurse was like, well, you got better shit to worry about than this. This this is nothing. No, this shit hurts. I don't like this shit. Take this shit out. Now, they told me I can't eat after 12 which is some bullshit. Um, I'm gonna wake up hungry. Fuck, they just don't know do it, but I really, I love me a little breakfast. You said you wanted a whole new breakfast item? I give you? He got geeked out his mind. At 10, they're gonna give me some medicine to thin out my cervix. And I told them, I'm just gonna get an epidural. I don't, I'm not even finna play games with their ass, cause this shit hurt. You can't hurt a real gangster. If this shit hurt, then I already motherfucking know. <laughs> Pushing that baby out, gonna feel like a bitch. I might as well just go and get the epidural, make this a smooth ride. Only reason I'm nervous because I just feel so normal. Like, I just feel so. I felt your heart through my hand, yes. Because it's just like. Yeah, it's just scary. Because I feel so fucking normal right now. So, when am I gonna start to feel like I'm in labor? I did tell my mom, just come in the morning, you know? But honestly, after they put that IV in my hand, I called her and I'm like, get here now. Get here time now. You might as well spend a night too, boo. I'm finna eat. Dad, I just wanted my food for me. I got some beef tips, yams, black eyed peas, mashed potatoes. Beans, greens, potatoes, tomatoes. They said I can't. What the fuck? You think you cheap keep done? You think you cheap keep done? The nurse should have busted in here and said, Sir, no, baby. Hey, hey, okay, you turn. Don't be looking scared when he come out. But I'm finna eat this, y'all. Then we're gonna watch a movie. And I'm gonna go to bed. So I'll give y'all an update. I'm sitting here like a book, like a crackhead. Baby, please don't be giving a crackhead while we get here. I do not need them thinking about my daddy crackhead. <laughs> they gonna be like, the bitch in that room, her husband dead on drugs. When he got geeked out his mind. It is 2.30 in the morning. I just took my second dose of medicine. Dad over here having a concert. The lady checked my cervix though. And she was like, oh, your cervix is right here. No wonder that shit don't be hurting. But I'm still two and a half centimeters dilated. 
My stomach hurt, but it's like, it hurt on some like, throw up shit. Mm -hmm. Thank you, my ass, huh? Look at my baby here. I promise I did. Four hours later. Bitch, I'm geeked. I ain't gonna lie. When he got geeked out his mind. I woke up, um, the cramps had intensified throughout the night. I'm still two and a half centimeters though. Lame. It doesn't hurt at all when they check my cervix. So that's a good sign. I'm just waiting on my doctor to come in here to break my water. Um, Hi, like. while I was asleep, pain was waking me up on my sleep. Like, it was hurting pretty bad. I'm like, what's up with that pain medicine? Like, what's up with that? Can I get that? And she's like, yeah, bitch, I don't know what they gave me, but I'm lit over here in this girl. She told me it's gonna feel like you, you had some margaritas. Two shots of vodka. Now I'm getting excited. I ain't scared no more. Now I'm excited. Just got my epidural. I had the best team ever because I didn't feel anything. And now we're just chilling until we get my water broken. Honestly, this has been the easiest experience of my life. <laughs> I had the best nurse ever. She told me the best points to get my medicine. Then the chief anesthesiologist did my epidural. So it didn't even hurt. I didn't even feel anything. And after that, I've been asleep, literally. It's like gonna be 11.30. I've been asleep since what, seven? And now I woke up and I'm nine centimeters. Let's do it. So I'm having a little jello. He been asleep. I'll be here too. She's, she's been up and active. Yeah, he been asleep. So I'm ready, I'm excited. I got the shakes right now. But that's the only thing I have everything has just been such a breeze. And soon, I think she said she's checking me at 12. That's when the party's gonna get started. And I, I have a feeling I'm gonna be 10 when she comes in and talk to me. I'm really like shaking it up. Some clothes. <laughs> so we having a baby today? <laughs> That's exactly how you be too sitting up. Talking about 10 right now. I am like nine and a half centimeters. We just got a little bit more to go. I'm feeling some pressure. But I also feel like I gotta throw up. The epidural is still working though. I started to feel a little contraction, but it's actually subsiding now. I think he was laying on a nerve and it wasn't allowing the epidural to get over there. But now that I flipped, the epidural is working and I'm feeling a little nauseous and I don't like feeling nauseous. So I'm just sniffing chemicals. I guess. I don't know. And I'm about to take some Zofran so I don't throw up while I'm giving birth. Because that is a no fucking go. <laughs> <laughs> Stop I can't believe I'm pregnant. <laughs> That's what I have to say. This ain't no steak of potatoes. This ain't no steak of potatoes. You got a tongue out. Your hair gonna be shaking while I'm holding your hand. And get nervous. You can see his head? If that's okay with you, I think I see. I think I see. No, it ain't that fine. Grab behind your legs, and this time I want you to curl up and over. That's it. Two, three, four. He got hair. I knew my jeans would come in soon. Where's your bottle? Yeah, I was. So I'm in recovery right now, and my nurse is leaving me. Hey. 
She was the best. She did I so wish, good. I wish everybody had the opportunity to have her as a labor and delivery nurse because this was smooth sailing. So everybody say bye to Savannah. Bye. She made it look easy. <laughs> We're leaving the hospital. So crazy. Miss Vicky is getting me together here. And we're about to see the motherland. Thank you. And now we're going home. Oh shit, that done hit his head. Yeah, my elbow. Live rock and roll, baby. Okay, then, gentlemen. Mm. Okay, then, gentlemen. 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 Okay,